Hello out there, YouTube friends. I'm Cindy. This is Sincerely Cindy Settle. Today, we have an Amazon haul. So, we're just going to jump right in to this Amazon haul. I will say that these all items are available on Prime's Try Before You Buy. Um, so, you, that is an option where if you have Amazon Prime, you can get these items to try them before you buy them. So, that means that you add them to your cart, they will send them to you, you have seven days to try them on, you keep what you want, they will charge you for the items that you keep, and then the other items you send back in the packaging that they came in. You do have labels to send everything back in the way that they came. So if you've never tried this service before, please be sure to keep your labels because you will need those to put those on your packages. So let's start off with this first set of items. This is just a very cute, comfortable sweater short set. I was so excited to get these. Um, I love the color. I think the lilac is very, very pretty. I feel like the fit is very good. I think the sleeves are fun on the shirt. This. They're both a sweater material and they are very matchy matchy. This is a sweater material short. They are elastic waistband. Again, they're very comfortable. The back does have this little slit in the back that I'm not sure that I'm a fan of in the back. Um, I feel like it kind of brings attention to the derriere area that, again, this is just a sweater. So if you have some dimpling, back there. It may kind of come through in the shorts. I'm not sure how much I would wear this. I don't even know that I would wear it out. Um, more of like a comfortable athleisure wear type of outfit for the home, but it is very comfortable. Again, the collar is very pretty. I'm going to get a little bit closer so you can see the collar, but I'm going to do a turnaround first. So maybe I'll check to see if they have this available in a different color. Then I might like it a little bit better. Not that I care about running around the house and having dimpling in my butt. That's not a big deal. But if I did want to wear it out, like to walk the dog or whatever, when it's a little chillier out, that might be something that I want to. Not that I care about that. You guys should see really when I walk the dog in, like pink Crocs I'm wearing to walk the dog, like Texas Longhorn uh, orange pants and like a Mountain Dew t-shirt. Like, I really don't care what I look like when I walk the dog. I don't even know why I said that. So anyway, so very fun athleisure wear type of outfit. So there you can see the collar just a little bit better. It does have a little bit of a drop sleeve. It is just a very pretty lavender lilac collar um, that's kind of unexpected in the cooler months. So I just thought it was kind of fun to give it a try. I will have all of the details of everything that you see today linked down below. It is a commissioned link. So if you do happen to purchase anything from those links, I do get a small commission. It doesn't raise the price for you. It just gives me a portion of what you are already going to spend on the item anyway. And usually it's just a couple of cents, maybe a dollar at the max. So all right, all right, so here we have the first of two dresses. So I really, really loved the color of this. I thought it was um, different from anything I have in my closet. I love the squared neckline. The sleeves are a lot of fun as well. It is more of a tiered look here. It is a little on the shorter side, so FYI. I will say it is a little bit tighter than what I would like here underneath the arms. I was hoping it would be um, a little looser there, but it is a little bit fitted throughout here, and then it does just kind of billow across the stomach area. Um, I'm on the fence with this one. I do really like it. I'm just not sure how much this would bother me. Um, it's not uncomfortably tight. It's just enough to notice it. I, again, I do think the square neckline is a lot of fun. I feel like this would look really cute with like over the knee boots. Um, unfortunately, it does not have pockets, um, but let me do a quick turnaround and then I will show you, um, the, give you a better look at the collar when I get a little closer. So let me know what you guys think about this one. Does it make me look a lot bigger than what I am? Should I do something more to cinch the waist? I don't know. I don't I don't know that I like cinching the waist on this. All right, let me get a little closer. 
So there you can see it's a very pretty charcoalish, uh, grayish blue color, um, square neckline. It comes up plenty high enough, very modest, cute billowy sleeves. Again, a little bit snugger here, but you can't notice it too much here in the breast area. Let me know what you think. Am I like way off in liking this at all? Or is it cute even for my age? What do they say? Wear what you love, it doesn't matter, or does it matter? You tell me. <laughs> all right, let's try the next one. Okay, so I kind of like this one as well. So this is, I would say, a little more on the springy side as opposed to the fall winter side. It is a short sleeve v-neck. It is a little more fitted and then flared um, down at the waist. does have buttons going down the front, which are a lot of fun. Um, they are not working buttons, so you don't have to worry about any gaping there. It is a tiered style dress. I feel like the fit is very good on this one for me as well. I like the collar. I think the collar is great. I do believe that this comes in other colors as well. Little cap sleeve. I feel like you could easily wear a cardigan over this with a pair of booties and get away with it for uh, a little bit of time. Actually, let me try this cardigan on with it now um, here in just a second and we can see what that looks like. I don't know that I would wear this particular cardigan, but I do have a cardigan here to try on as well, so might as well get it done, right? So the length isn't bad either. I feel like the length is a good length. Let me know what you think. A very pretty hunter green collar with grayish brown, grayish brown buttons there. Again, no gaping because they are not working buttons. So let's try this cardigan. So what do you think? I think that works. I think it's a good transition. This is a very comfortable cardigan. Very cute. Got a little slit here, has the pockets. It is more of a pawpaw type sweater, has the cute buttons going down the front. The fit's great. Gosh, a lot of cute options in this, in this Amazon haul. That's cute. All right, I'm gonna try this on again with some jeans. I do have some heels um, to try on. I'm gonna try those on with a pair of jeans. Okay, so here you can have a look at the sweater with just a pair of jeans and then a black tank top. Um, you guys have seen this tank top numerous times. What do you guys think about this length? Is it too short for me? Is it kind of cutting me off um, in a non-flattering area? Is it bringing too much attention to this area? Let me know what you think. I like it. I think I would like it better with if it weren't a v-neck here. I think like a crew neck would look really cute with it. Um, you could even roll those up a little bit if you wanted to. I feel like the look is very cute. All right, so I also have on a pair of Vince Camuto heels. I have been looking for a pair of black heels similar to this. I'm gonna pan down um, and we'll talk about those. So here we have some strappy Vince Camuto stiletto heels. The heel is not overly high. I wanna say it's probably a two and a half inch. There is a little bit of support down towards the bottom of the heel where it gets a little bit thicker. It is strappy around the ankle and does have a solid back as well as a pointed solid toe. Um, these are very similar to what I have in my closet already, but the ones I have in my closet are not in the greatest shape. So I have been looking for a pair and these might be them. So let me know what you think. I wouldn't wear these together, just FYI. I mean, you could, I mean, it looks fine. Um, just not something that I would wear unless I were going to a concert or something like that. Then I might wear it with a graphic tee or something like that. Um, that would be really cute. All right, I think that's it. I will be right back and wrap things up. All right, so I feel like we had some good stuff in this. Amazon try before you buy haul. What do you guys think? What were your favorites? What were your least favorites? What do you think I should keep? What should I send back? I love hearing from you guys. Let me know. So here's a better look at the Vince Camuto heels. They are just a basic black stiletto with a strappy um, strap. Strappy strap. Strappy strap. Um, and I want to say probably a two and a half 
inch heel there. And these are, let's talk prices, how shall we? These are, yikes, I don't know if we're keeping these or not. These are 119. I thought they were more like on the $80 side. So I saw these originally on Stitch Fix on Freestyle. And so I did a search for them to see if I could find them cheaper. I can't remember if they're any cheaper or not. Cheaper or not. I want to say they were like $87. Maybe the price has gone up. I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to check to see what the price is on Amazon. Check on Stitch Fix. Check on other sites as well just to get an idea of what those are because I do like them. And I have been looking for a pair. All right, so let's talk about the cardigan. This is by The Drop. It is $49.90. I'm not 100% sold on this yet. I think it's really cute. Um, I'm just not sure that it's for me. So let me know what you think about that. Then we have the pullover sweater in dusty purple that's this one here these pieces this and the shorts were sold separately this is $39.90 didn't love it and I feel like that's a little pricey and then the shorts are $34.90 so it's almost like 70 bucks for this cute little outfit not that it's bad for an outfit I mean you're getting a whole outfit but again I don't know that I would wear that out anywhere for some people they would be fine wearing that out like my daughters would completely wear that out I'm just not sure that I would and then we have the tiered dress in blue this is a little pricier than what I thought too dang this is $65 so let me know what you think about this if you think it's worth the money again I think it would look really cute with knee-high boots and like a moto jacket or a leather jacket or whatever I'm trying to talk myself into it aren't I <laughs> this one is a very good price it is $28.79 so with all that being said let me know what you think let me know if you like this kind of content if you do like this kind of content I hope that you will consider subscribing I am always looking for your support like this video share it hit the notification bell so that you can get all the videos I love hearing from you guys let me know if there's something new that you guys would like to see or other subscription boxes out there that you would like to see I am like I've said before trying to do a little bit better to do some hauls so I'm hoping to get some of those in as well again that's more of about the expense of the haul as opposed to anything else um, you know you do have to put that money out ahead of time and then anything you don't want you would take you know take back and then get a refund so a little bit more difficult to keep track of the finances that way so I am going to try to do some of those um, I know that you guys have been asking for them so again I always appreciate your support I will have links and descriptions down below in the description bar there are also referral codes down there for stitch fix uh, wantable uh, transcend and I think that's all all right, I will see you guys soon. I am Sincerely Cindy Settle. I'm signing out. Mwah.